Tucson to get on the 2019 election ballot. News 4 Tucson's Danelle Confair has the latest. It's now in the hands of a superior court judge who will decide if the Green Party should be allowed on the 2019 ballot. The lawsuit claims the Green Party of Pima County was illegally removed from the 2019 ballot. In court, the city of Tucson said the Green Party did not qualify in time by not having submitted 969 valid signatures by March 25th. Members of the Green Party said the writing in their petition dating back to 2017 says they are an eligible political party for two years of election cycles. The city of Tucson admitted in court that the petition had the wrong language. They provided us with the following statement regarding the lawsuit that reads in part, the Green Party had qualified for the ballot via a new party petition in 2017, but subsequently did not meet either of the requirements for maintaining qualification. Their voter participation level in the November 2018 election was too low, and their voter registration numbers as of April 2019 also were not sufficient for them to remain qualified for the ballot. Chairperson for the Green Party of Pima County disagrees. I believe that justice is on our side. Um, you know, we followed the instructions that they gave us. Williams says that by the time the Green Party learned their 2017 petition didn't qualify them for the 2019 primary ballot, it was too late to submit signatures. Again, it's not our it's not our error. It's the error of the city of Tucson, and. Um, Ultimately, because it's their error, we will hopefully prevail in the end. That decision wouldn't be handed down to the next few days. We'll keep you updated on KVOA.com. I'm Danelle Confair, News 4 Tucson. Coming up tonight.